don't know if you can see that little tiny baby duck, but apparently it's been ado adopted by the geese. Speaking of birds, I was uh, fishing, I got caught like six little tiny bluegill, and when they're little tiny babies like that, usually you would put them back, but I decided to save them in my bucket. Uh, I have a little cooler, and then I bring them here, back to the wild, Wildlife Re Rehabilitation Center. Um, they have a couple of eagles, one of them is completely blind, so obviously he wouldn't be able to go back to the wild, but, um, there are some that, seagulls and things like that, and the, uh, what they do is, with the fish, they'll feed the birds, so, that's what I did today. So, like I said, just now I... Leaving the uh, back to the wild, and uh, they do a lot of good stuff. I've been every any any time that I go to the reservoir for uh, Lake Erie to fish, and I catch something that's too small for me to eat, or if I just don't want to eat it, as long as it's not a um, catfish, because apparently they don't like catfish. Even sheephead, they'll take some size sheephead, not the really, really humongous one, but they'll take the small, baby one. Because the, they, I think they have some cranes over there, maybe? Something like that? Well, anyways, that's what I, I like to do that every time. I've been doing that for a couple of years now. Also, when I was fishing, I saw a bunch of uh, fishing line all over the place, and I picked up some and threw it away, and uh, I found a couple of jigs and uh, a couple of one, couple of fake one. There was a fake minnow and a fake leech that I can use, so that's always good. Anywhere I go, I try to pick up some kind of trash. Obviously, take up your own trash. Take up my own trash. You know. Alright, have a good day guys.